Anthony Wayne High School proudly presents Sweet Surrender by Michael McKeever. A hilarious fable set in the 1940s about the happenings at one of California's finest hotels, the Palm Beach Royale. You have your classic duo of bellhops, the frazzled Otis. Can I have your autograph? It's for my mother. She's very sick. Her name is Otis. And his charming friend, Francis. I guess you can just look at me and, you know. Both gentlemen are preparing for the night's event while trying to meet the needs of their boss, Bernard S. Dunlap, the general manager of the Palm Beach Royale. You see, Mr. Pippin, the trick is to not panic. Not panicking is key. As long as one doesn't panic, there is nothing. Absolutely nothing. That can't be handled. <sighs> he is trying to keep his cool, despite the many complications inflicted by everyone's boss, Mrs. Everett P. Osgood, society matron and president of the Palm Beach Ladies for Unity. The night's festivities have already begun, and might I say just between you and me, I think they're going very well. Are they? The night's event will be showcasing one of Hollywood's stars of the stage and screen, Athena Sinclair. Oh, Murphy, enough! Claudia McFadden is a biopic woman, and I want nothing to do with her. Now that's really all there is to it. Now I refuse to waste another second discussing her. Is that understood? The struggle is making sure she doesn't run into her rival, Claudia McFadden, the other one of Hollywood's biggest divas. with copious eye makeup and countless lovers. Too many men and not enough talent. I really need to get your sheet. All packaging and no substance. You know, they tried to do that to me once, when I first came to Hollywood. They tried to make me fit into that mold, but I defied them. I broke that mold, didn't I? Oh, yes. And every diva needs a personal secretary. Mr. Pippet is stuck with Miss McFadden, waiting on her every hand and foot. Make time for you? I think not. You know what it's like to get that damn little dog to swallow an aspirin? And besides, I still have to get Miss McFadden dressed, get her fed, and... Why are there still no white roses in this suite? Then there's the cute and practical Murphy Stevens, Miss Sinclair's personal secretary. I've seen the way those people live. Always being hounded by the press. Who wants to live like that? Not me. All I've ever really wanted was to be married to some nice fellow who made an honest living and didn't die in the war. And with two Hollywood stars in the same suite, you just can't keep the press away. Dora Del Rio is the gossip columnist who tries to interview the two divas. Sorry, in the suite. I can smell it. That's not a story you smell. It's me. And who couldn't love the spoiled little laptop Mr. Boodles? Come see a play filled with two gorgeous divas, incompetent bellhops, navy men up to no good, true love, crazy hotel managers, feuds and laughter, mistaken identities, overblown egos, and one pampered little laugh dog. They all round out this hilarious riot of a comedy, an all-out love note to the classic farces of the 30s and 40s. There's no telling what might happen if the two stars see each other. Come spend your sweet time with us on November 21st and 22nd at 8 p.m. and November 23rd at 2 p.m. and 8 p.m. in the Anthony Wayne High School Auditorium. Tickets are sold at the door. Adults $8, student and senior citizens $6, children 12 and under $5. Online tickets now available. Please visit our website. A $1 service charge is added to each ticket when ordering. If you have any further questions, please contact Kate Hoover at her email, khoover at anthonywayneschools.org or at 419-877-0466.